Good morning. Today is Wednesday, March the 8th, 2017, about 7.45. It's 60 degrees out here this morning, so it's going to be warm today. They had rain forecaster for during the night that we really needed, but all it did was make enough to maybe drip off the roof. The, drowns, the ground still looks dry. We need a whole lot more. And Larry on his way to Hardy's. Larry brought these strawberries in out of the strawberry patch for me yesterday afternoon and evening, but I was too full of pizza then to eat them, so I'm having them for breakfast with frozen yogurt. It's going to be good. Here's a little update on the English peas. Looks like they're up to the third, almost to the fourth string. There's the rutabagas. Doing real good. Down there on the end is the kale. I'm gonna need to cut some of it and make some kale chips. And the spinach is grown again. I'm gonna have to pick it. I think I'll probably end up freezing some. The peach tree's starting to bloom. Buds are opening. Just the first ones. Our rose bush has got a few blossoms on it. Now he's going to do above ground potatoes again this year, so I come out to try and help a little bit. Right about there, kind of down here. Right, right down through here. wet ground or damp ground, it won't, it won't start growing. This, you wouldn't have to be too bothered to get to the world on the planet, then you just got the potatoes. Now I had to work on the tire on the on the golf cart it went flat. So he wore his back out doing that. See, there's more than two, I get more, I get at least two eyes. If you get two eyes, I cut them in half. If you can't, you just can't get rid of it. Three more. Huh? Three more. That was $4.50 worth of seed potatoes, so they're all laying down through there on top of the ground, and Ted's coming to bring some straw for Larry. Hey, Ted's here. He brought the straw.
I'm making cheeseburger macaroni for lunch. It's like a hamburger helper type thing. And I've got uh, water and milk in there, cooking with not already browned the hamburger, and added a cup and a half of macaroni. And then the spices I added a tablespoon of cornstarch, two teaspoons of paprika, teaspoon of onion powder, teaspoon of garlic, teaspoon of salt, teaspoon of sugar. And then we're supposed to stir in a cup of cheddar cheese shredded. And I've got this block of cheese here that Maxine gave us. It's been in the freezer. So I'm going to slice it and then kind of shred it and put it in. I added my cheese there on top, so once that melts, it'll be ready. All right, he's got his potatoes all covered now. He decided he wanted to uh, wet around them good. Because it's so dry. Mm-hmm. And put the hay on. Oh. Larry just cut the twine on the bale of hay, and now he's putting it over the potatoes. Want me to help you? Yeah. You have to have your gloves. My gloves? Okay. Huh? Okay. Make the hands roll. I'm doing a little touch-up ironing with one of the Larry's pairs of jeans, his Wranglers. Larry's back working on the rototiller. Since I already had the iron hot, I decided to go ahead and shorten another pair of Larry's slacks that he found in the closet. It's easier for me to do it than to pick it up. Okay. It's all bent up because we had a 120-pound pig to get it one time. We had to Cut him up to get him out. 120-pound pig in that cage would be... <laughs> yeah, well, cage full. Couldn't get him out. He bent it. Look how he broke it. Uh-huh. So big when he got it. Was it a wild pig? Yeah. Plantation. Azalea's next door. There's more azaleas in front of the church. Everything's blooming now. We're here at the bank. And now we're leaving. Here we are at Ted's house. I guess the critter's getting in his garbage cans while he needs it. Ted's not home right now, so we're just going to leave it here. Larry called him. We went ahead and set it. Just a hook holds the gate up. Door. Here we are at Burger King, getting our Whopper Juniors and small fries. We ate our supper here by the duck pond in this little subdivision. Azaleas are blooming everywhere there, and dogwoods, dogwoods are all coming out. Mm -hmm. Pretty. A lot of the homes just have azaleas blooming all the way around them. One big azalea bush right there. Home sweet home. Now he's picking up pine cones in case we need them in the morning. These are big ones out here. There's a pretty sunset. Six twenty-three, and the sun is down, and the sky is pretty. We're on our way to church to the business meeting. They're usually pretty quick. The 
both sides of the road are done, so we got a nice smooth ride to church. We spoke too soon, the good road ended, and we're back to the regular road. It's like most everybody's here. Church is over and we're leaving. Good night. God bless.